The coronavirus is spreading. But you already know that. What you may not know is that you can help. Currently, Alaska is one of six states with less than 500 confirmed cases of COVID-19. What about the other states? Some have over 20 times that amount, with New York being the highest at 200,000 confirmed cases. And we. That's you. That's me. Us. Together. We can make a change. 2020 has gotten off to a crazy start. As I'm sure we're all aware, we're living in difficult and uncertain times. Alaska has been one of the few states in America that has been able to significantly slow the spread of the COVID-19 pandemic that is spreading rapidly to our friends and families in the lower 48. But our fight against the disease isn't over yet. To prevent our cases from increasing rapidly, we need to take action now, not only to protect ourselves, but also our community. We're here to challenge Alaska's youth in making a statement to help our community by wearing masks and promoting their use. Just recently, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention officially stated that they recommend wearing cloth masks out in public. Their recent studies have also shown that the virus can still be transmitted through asymptomatic carriers. This means that we must be careful around others even if we don't feel symptoms. Remember, even if you don't feel sick, you can still get others sick. Right now, you might be thinking, Hey, I'm already practicing social distancing. I'm staying away from my friends at a distance of six feet. I'm cleaning everything in my household. And I'm washing my hands so much they're perpetually dry. What else could I possibly do? Well, I'm glad you asked. Staying physically distant is great, but that doesn't mean the disease can't transfer from the surfaces you've touched. Without masks, you could create a potential danger to anyone who comes into contact with those surfaces. Any mask is better than no mask at all. Plus, it's a great reminder to keep your hands away from your face. When you're stepping out to a public place like the grocery store or pharmacy, social distancing measures like standing six feet apart can be harder to follow, which is why it's important to wear a face mask to reduce possible risks. With that said, there are also some precautions you should know. Cloth face covering shouldn't be worn by children under two, anyone who has trouble breathing or is unable to remove the mask by themselves. They should also be washed regularly and avoid contact with your eyes, nose, and mouth when taking them off. Wash your hands thoroughly and immediately after removal. Together right now, we're building an active community among the Alaskan youth who can contribute to our state's future and reduce cases in a flattening curve. Our mission is to engage the youth of Alaska, to promote mask wearing, and to donate our homemade masks to our local hospitals for patients and healthcare workers, as well as other organizations in need. Our task is to create as many masks as possible out of cotton material. Currently, many people have already started producing and donating masks to hospitals across Alaska. Our hope is for the youth to help increase mask production for those most vulnerable to the disease through donation. With the youth becoming a part of this increasing family of mask makers, we can help make a large difference by contributing to our community during this crisis. Our world is connected through social media. Let's use these connections to advocate for the health of our people. Help us spread the word. Follow us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube, and share this video with the hashtag MaskMissionAK. Post a picture of yourself wearing or making masks to share this mission with your friends and family. Now is the time for our generation to make a mark in this moment of history. Let's take action now, starting with the homemade mask.